Hello, dear brothers and sisters in Christ. Welcome back once again to the office here, my office <laughs> at the old convent at Immaculate Conception. Uh, we're making our way through the alphabet uh, little by little. Um, today's is going to be a little bit different um, in that it's not explicitly related to our Catholic Christian faith, but it is all the same significant for us living here in the United States. So we're on the letter W that we could talk about Washington. So I pulled up a picture there on my computer, <laughs> uh, the Washington Monument there in Washington, D.C., or the District of Columbia. And it is uh, representative, of course, of our first president, George Washington, uh, within the uh, special place there of Washington, D.C., is the National Basilica of the Immaculate Conception. And so a very significant name for us, of course, here in Columbia Heights. Um, but there, of course, uh, she is the patroness of D.C., but actually all of the United States, our Blessed Mother, under her title of the Immaculate Conception. So we ask for her prayers for us in our country. We just celebrated the 4th of July. And with so many things going on in our country, uh, we ultimately need that outpouring of God's grace and that strength that we can continue to draw closer to one another and ultimately to God. And so we ask for the prayers of our Blessed Mother this day. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. God bless you, all the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Take care and see you soon, God willing.